Greetings, Jedis. This is Captain Rex, and you're watching Star Wars Nut 77, home of the Star Wars memorabilia reviews. Move out! Hey guys, what's going on? This is John, Star Wars Nut 77. I've heard that uh, Toy Dress has a whole bunch of exclusives out now, so let's, I'm at my local Toy Dress, so let's go on undercover and see what they have. Alright, so here I am entering uh, the Toys R Us. Let's see what they've got. Got a whole bunch of Halloween stuff up now, and you know, Halloween's around the corner, so sometimes they have some stuff up front. So let's see if uh, they have any, and uh, sure enough, uh, they do. Actually, you can see there's a little island here with a whole bunch of Star Wars stuff. These are mini tins. I've never seen these before. These got interesting multi packs, mighty tin. Hmm. The one that was kind of Darth Vader shaped, that a Death Star shaped is one. A lot of the Death Star ones are kind of in really bad shape, though, to be honest with you. So that was uh, interesting to see. There's a gaming area right there ahead of straight ahead. Around the corner and then approaching the, the Star Wars aisle. They have a little island here as well with some lightsabers ranging from $9 to $23. Here's the Blu-ray four packs. These are $25 each. Um, I prefer the Force Effects lightsabers out right now rather than these plastic ones. For, you know, I don't know, $15 more you get the Force Effects. It's a multi-pack. Battle packs are now twenty dollars, but they only come with three figures now. On the other side of this island, they had some other figures as well, um, some, some guns. This is this is really cool. This is the exclusive Y wing fighter, the Toys R Us. You can see the emblem in the top right corner there with the, the R, the Toys R Us logo. This is a really uh, retro vintage uh, edition uh, set, rather. So that's pretty cool to see. That's retailing for thirty nine ninety nine. That says Toys R Us exclusive as well. I figure right there. A lot of Anakin's, a lot of Obi Wan Kenobi's, a lot of Mace Windu's. That's the new boxing movie, metal st or steel boxing, whatever movies out right now. Figures. Uh, oh, this is a cool exclusive. This is a clone trooper. Uh, that's a Toys R Us exclusive as well. Death Star Trooper. I don't see that very often in a while. That's kind of interesting to see. They're retailing for eight ninety nine. They also have the talking helmets there, the face masks. The, the vintage collection, they, they had uh, a few of these. They're kind of sparse on, on the vintage collection now, to be honest with you, but we've tried for $9.99. They had Dengar and uh, Fulgon. Nothing too out of the ordinary. Rebel Trooper. Some more Clone Clone War figures. This is cool. This is a Toys R Us exclusive as well. Genosian Warrior with with speeder bike. It looks like, and that's uh, Separatist Speeder. So that's cool. Toys R Us. You can see the logo, the Toys R Us logo there. Those are eighteen ninety nine. And uh, got some battle packs. Th those are the Force Effects lightsabers I was talking about. Much rather have those than the, the $23 ones. We have a Darth Vader one and an Anakin one. This is a Toys R Us exclusive as well. This is a Droid Attack 3, three set with a, kind of a spider droid. That's a really cool set. I think that was uh, $24.99. Here's another Toys R Us exclusive. This is Battle, Battle Over Endor. There's two of them, four set. These, these are $31.99. A little, little expensive for four, four figures. Uh, here's the other one. 
pretty cool though you know cool exclusive figures you can see the R emblem right there Toys R Us R emblem there's so many Toys R Us exclusives out right now it's crazy but for $31.99 I think it's kind of expensive for four figures even though they are exclusives messing around with the lightsaber there trying to put it away they have it balancing on these figures it's kind of tricky more Toys R Us exclusives this is the Star Wars uh, these are the video game ones of Force Unleashed uh, and uh, you have the Rogue Squadron, and uh, these are cool. They're, they're only twenty four ninety nine, so they're cheaper than the other set. And they come with five figures, so it doesn't really make sense. The pricing doesn't make sense on these. Uh, Republic Commando set, rather, not the Rogue Squadron. So Republic Commando, cool set though. They just came out recently. All exclusive for Toys R Us. They have the, the logo there, Toys R Us logo. And a little bit, it has a synopsis of uh, each character there. This is really cool right here. This is the Death Star uh, set with X-Wing and you got the um, TIE Fighter as well. TIE Interceptor. This is exclusive Toys R Us. It comes with Luke, RTD2, Darth Vader. I didn't, it retails for $99.99, $100. But the reason I didn't get this is because uh, the X-Wing wing was actually broken off. But you can see it's a really cool set. I was really surprised to see this. This just came out, um, and it's really neat. RTD2 looks really cool. He's got a really cool paint paint job on him. You kind of see that he's got the flap too, which is really neat. And just the way you have it displayed is really cool. Awesome set, and it's super huge, kind of heavy, very bulky. So I'll, I'll hopefully find one another one in the wild with better shape because I can imagine shipping on that is not going to be cheap. It's hard to get online. At the bottom of the Star Wars logo. See what else they have. Star Wars stuff they have here. Some plush Star Wars stuff. This is uh, perimeter droids. That's interesting. That must be new. I haven't seen that before. The Empire Strikes Back lunch pail tin. A lot of these old school tins are kind of coming back, I guess. Some Iron Man toys. See what else? Another aisle they have uh, some Marvel Universe figures, and they have uh, some Batman figures, some other exclusives. I love the Marvel Universe line as well. There's the Joker. It's pretty cool. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for commenting. We'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.